Hello again. Let's start with football. And Hearts have escaped a points punishment from the SPL after failing to pay their players on time last month. The Tynecastle Club have been warned. Their signing ban remains and they could be hit with fresh sanctions later this week. Keith Downey has more from Hamden. Yes, the corridors of power here at Hamden were a busy thoroughfare today with three top-level meetings taking place. League reconstruction and voting structures were high up on the agenda, but top of that was Hearts and their punishment for the late payment of player wages for September. Uh, we considered a charge against Hearts that uh, they were late paying their September at wages, both players and coaching staff. Uh, Hearts admitted the charge and uh, were given a warning as to future conduct and a reprimand. Uh, separately, there's a second uh, hearing in respect of a second charge, which will be heard this Wednesday. I think the clubs uh, set out very clearly over the summer with a new set of rules that uh, uh, they were very clear needed to be brought in, uh, that clubs had to pay players and officials on time. Where there is a failure, then the club should be sanctioned. And that's what happened here. It's a very, very challenging time, but it is something we do believe we're making headway with. And I would say that the, you know, the funding is still there for the club. There's no question about that. But we understand that it's very important to pay wages on time um, and we'll do everything we possibly can. But without crystal ball, it's difficult to say. Whether positively or negatively, the late payment of wages has had an effect on the Hearts players. Well, it brings the team together as well. And you kind of feel that and we kind of want to show that on the park. We've got good players there and we've got a lot of competition for places as well and it kind of keeps everybody on their toes. So it's just it's one of these things in football at the minute at, the, well, at Hearts as well. So we kind of just need to deal with it. So while Hearts have been reprimanded and warned over their future conduct, the problem for the Edinburgh club doesn't end there. David Southern will be back here again on Wednesday where Hearts face a similar charge for offences made this month. Back to you. Keith Downey reporting from Hamden earlier. We'll have the action from Hearts. 1-0 win over Motherwell in just a moment. Hearts defender Danny Granger says keeping a clean sheet against Motherwell yesterday meant more to him than scoring the 25-yard power strike that sealed the three points. While Hearts enjoyed victory at Tynecastle, Hibbs trip to the Highlands ended in disappointment. Despite the off-field troubles at Tynecastle, Hearts kept their eye on the ball this weekend. And it took Danny Granger just 14 minutes to do the business.